Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have a haul, a clothing haul try on style for you guys. And basically, this all happened because I was going shopping for an IMAX outfit and I literally just wanted to get an outfit for that one night. And I saw a lot of stuff that I liked that I just decided to pick up. And then I also have some things that I picked up online. So basically what I'm going to be doing is showing you guys every single piece that I picked up. And I'm going to try them on for you guys as well. And if you want to see the outfit that I did agree on or settle on or chose. <laughs> okay, I don't know why I'm being weird. The outfit that I chose for iMats, I will put a few pictures here right now. I wore this to iMats and then I also wore it to the NYX after party. I really liked it. I picked it up at Too Cute and I think that it was perfect. So with that being said, the first pieces of clothing that I'm going to be showing you guys are from Too Cute. I have the bag right here. It's so funny. My boyfriend actually calls Too Cute the thought store and I have to tend to agree. Like their clothes are more risque but I don't go there for like normal everyday clothes I go there for like party clothes um, I'm going on vacation at the end of May into April to Dominican Republic so I had that in mind and these are the kind of clothing that I wear you know like when I'm going out at night not really every single day so yes it might be a thought store but you know what sometimes you just want to thought out no, I'm kidding. Everything is actually very tasteful. You guys that you guys know that I've never really liked to show, you know, like too much boob, cleavage, um, booty, like any cheeks hanging out or anything. But sometimes a little bit of back, a little bit of stomach, like a crop top definitely is my style. So I have everything piled right here. And actually the two pieces that I'm going to show you guys first are from Charlotte Roos. Um, this is from when I went shopping with my two friends, Rocio and Nicole. We saw these shirts, I believe Rocio, which is Miss Barbie Baby here on YouTube. Um, I believe she picked this up as well. Or if not, I know she definitely showed this to me. And this is a crop top. And I really, really love the style of it because it has this mesh that kind of dips down really low. And I am just in love with crop tops. I feel like they look so classy but sexy with a pair of high-waisted jeans. I literally could, could live in crop tops and high-waisted jeans. That is like my go-to outfit. And you guys know how I am when I see something that I like. I pick it up in multiple colors so they also did have it in white which is seriously my favorite color to wear out of everything so I picked up the white one as well and I really like these these are relatively cheap I took off the tags but I believe that they were like 13 or 14 dollars each so that is the first thing that I have to show you guys and then next everything else I believe is from too cute so the first thing that I picked up is another crop top and this one is actually a I believe it's called a crew neck crop top I really like the material because it's extra stretchy and then the detail at the bottom it looked a little bit weird on the hanger but it still intrigued me to try it on it kind of has a crisscross design going along the bottom of it and I really like that this shirt was $14.99 I got it in a size small everything that I'm going to show you guys today is a size small a lot of you guys know that I lost a lot of weight when I went through some stuff in December so my weight has gone down and now I am a size small pretty much everywhere that I go. But I like this a lot. I can definitely see myself wearing this on my vacation to DR in about a month. And the same thing with this next dress. I, again, was trying on all these pieces thinking of iMats and I was like, I don't know. I'm either going to wear it to iMats, but if I don't, I'm definitely going to wear it somewhere else. So this is a white dress and you guys, literally... Wait till you see this on. It has kind of like a lacy mesh detail at the top. I believe that this is called a sweetheart neckline. And the way that it just hugs onto your body and your curves is just like, whoa. It's amazing. Now, I'm not going to lie. It has a very, very high slit, um, which is something that I would only wear with stockings underneath because I don't feel comfortable showing too, too much. But it is definitely a very, very sexy dress. It's something that I would probably wear out um, in DR, like going out to dinner or going to a club with a tan because everyone knows if you're going to wear all white dress or even all white crop tops that you have to have a banging tan because even though I'm going to try these on for you guys right now, I'm sure that I'm going to look pretty crazy in my pale state. But I still want you guys to get the idea. And that was $29.99. The next dress was also $29.99. Again, a size small. 
and this is kind of like a I think it's called an Aztec print I don't know I saw this on one of the mannequins that they had at Too Cute and I was like oh yes I need to try that on I knew that I was not gonna wear this to IMAX because I wanted something a little bit more fancy and stand out but um, I don't know I just like this dress a lot and I like on the sides that it has the black paneling very very flattering it gives you kind of that hourglass shape the material is very very stretchy and it is super super fitted that's why I got it in a small I almost went with a medium because it kind of had a looser fit then at the end I was like no nah, I think I want the small so I picked this one up and then the only other things that I got from Too Cute or actually don't think that these are from Too Cute now that I think about it this one is from Forever 21 and this is a pencil skirt I love pencil skirts you guys if you're like me itty bitty titty committee and no booty you have to get into pencil skirts because I'm telling you they make everyone look like you got a nice big juicy booty I love pencil skirts especially the ones that go a little bit lower like right above the knees or to the knees it kind of just makes your booty pop out and it makes it look like you have a booty even if you don't so this is from forever 21 it's a longer style and this is in the size small and this was $14.99 so I really love this I can see myself wearing this a lot in the summertime with just like a casual tank top probably like a black casual tank top this pencil skirt and then black sandals um, gladiator style or even some black flats I like to keep these very very casual because sometimes pencil skirts can look a little bit business like and that's not really the look that I'm going for and then the last one I did get this for IMATS because I knew that I was gonna be wearing a two-piece set but I did not end up wearing it it is a white stretchy skirt and this one is definitely a lot more dressy than the last one because of the material um, this is a size small and this one was $29.99 this one was actually from Charlotte Russe and it's not as flattering as the last one because again it doesn't go down as low on the body but you really can't go wrong with a pencil skirt it really is flattering to many many body types so those are all the things that I picked up from my mall trip Again, I was really just supposed to go for one thing and I picked up a lot of other things, but hey, come on. You know when you're looking forward to a vacation that you have that in the back of your head, so I don't even feel guilty. I don't. All right, so here is my next pile of things and I even forgot what I got here. So these are from OASAP and I didn't even try these on yet, so you guys will see when I put my overlay of what they look like on how they end up looking and I really hope that this is an item that I am going to love this is a bathing suit I did again have this in mind for a vacation I don't even know if I'm gonna try this one on for you guys it might be a little bit weird to show you me in a bathing suit but maybe I'll just show you certain areas I don't know so it's a, it has like a one um, what is it called like a one shoulder design it does have padding and then it's that monokini I think that it's called and look at the side detail you guys like this is what will go around the hips I just thought that this was so sexy and I have been seeing a lot of bathing suits like this on Instagram so when I saw this on OASAP I'm like yes I definitely need to try this I'm gonna put the links to every single thing that I show you guys from OASAP down below and what I got next this one I did try on when my package first came in because I thought that this might be something that I wore to IMATS but it wasn't very form-fitting it was a little bit more loose and casual than I wanted to go for the look that I wanted to go for but it's still so so gorgeous I can picture myself wearing this on like New Year's or like a Christmas party which I know right now is not the time to be thinking of that but that's just what it reminds me of it has a dip down what is it called like a cutout right over here and it goes all the way down low it is a dress it is very very flowy and very very short so I feel like that is the reason why it works it can be very short because it's not form-fitting at all it's a loose and flowy but it does definitely show a lot of leg and then you have this cut out a very deep v-neck in the front so kind of works I really like it and super super affordable everything from OASAP is ridiculously affordable um, this is another thing from OASAP that I believe it was like ten dollars so I picked it up and it is a floral dress I live in dresses during the summertime so I definitely can't wait to wear this one it's an off-the-shoulder dress which I really love that style and this is what it looks like I don't know what this one is gonna look like on it is one size fits all but you guys will see right now when I try it on I think it's really really gorgeous these are definitely the type of dresses that I live in all summer long so that's that one and then next I got a white peplum dress now excuse me you guys this definitely has to be ironed but 
I could not help myself because of the neckline. I thought it was so, so gorgeous and so different from anything else that I own. It kind of has like a square cut out design and it's a peplum. So it's very, very flattering. It makes you look like you have more of a butt. It makes you look like you have a hip, like hip, a hip, not a hip. It makes it look like you have hips. And it's a very cute, very flattering dress. Definitely more dressy. So I can see myself going out to dinner on a summer night wearing something like this or maybe an event. And you guys know me and my white, so I definitely had to pick that one up. Next item that I picked up was actually supposed to be a dress, but when I tried it on, it was very, very short. This is one of the ones that I tried on right away. I really love it. I love the design of it. However, the neckline goes down really, really low, and if I pull it down more to make the dress cover my butt, then the neckline is all the way down. So I have to play around with this. I might have to wear a camisole or bandeau underneath so I can pull it down pretty low. Or if not, then I'm just going to have to wear it as a shirt. I did get it in a size small, so I probably should have gotten it in a size large if I wanted to wear it as a dress. But either way, I will make it work. I love the striped navy and white design. It reminds me of like a sailor. And I feel like I want to wear this with red lipstick. And yeah, I can't wait to wear this one. And then I only have one more piece to show you guys, which is this one right here. And it has lint on it. This is something very different from anything else that I own. It's a maxi dress, I want to say, but a short maxi dress. It hits me about ankle length, and it is all white once again, so I really have to get working on my tan. And it's very, very sexy. This is what the neckline looks like right here. It dips down very, very low. It has some cutouts in the back, and it's kind of like a cotton material that I think is perfect for the beach. So I think that I would wear this over a bathing suit going to the beach because it does have such a, a very low neckline that I would not feel comfortable showing that much but it does have like a not a terry cloth but kind of a towel like material I am horrible at describing things but it literally reminds me of a towel and I feel like it would be really nice for the summer days when you're going to the beach and you just want to have something to cover up after if you're going to eat or anything like that so that is everything that I picked up this is what Lee does when she looks for one outfit to go to IMAX, she ends up with all of these outfits. So let me know if you guys want to see a haul video. I think I want to go on a big shopping trip getting only things for my vacation. I want a couple of more bathing suits. I want some like nice clubbing outfits for night, some outfits to go out to dinner with, and then some casual like beachy outfits. So if you guys want to see a clothing haul on that, definitely let me know. Thank you guys all so much for watching, and I will see you all in my next video. Mwah.